What's up, Ace Actually met Ace Row about 13 years ago. Back when we used to work at Dollars. We used to hang out. Well, I'm not gonna go into details, but yeah. And uh, he just moved out here Friday. I mean, perfect timing. And also, he hit me up. A, he hit me up while I was on the Appalachian Trail, out of the blue one day, and said he wanted to hike the AT and was planning on it this year, but COVID happened. But whenever he hit me up, I was here, standing right over there. Boom. So that's pretty cool how all of this worked out, and we're gonna do the loop. So uh, awesome, Four Pines Hostel. Stayed here for three days. Good times. This is gonna be awesome. We're gonna start, we're starting a little bit later than planned, but um, everything worked out. So we're gonna leave the car here, but it's all good. Everything worked out. What's hey, up, nature boy? Chilling, man, nothing like good vibes and good folks at the Four Pines Hostel. That's right, man. My man's still holding it down at Four Pines. When this dude picked me up in the shuttle, he was busting out that Rammstein. Oh that yeah, that fucking Rammstein self-titled <laughs> album from last year. We yeah. were, uh, that was a very memorable ride. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Back at the Four Pines. We're off. Well, first mile was pretty rough. <laughs> Dang. Out of shape. But it's all good. Made me think about my life a little bit up there. And that first hill was a doozy. I like this part. <laughs> this part's been fun. Yep. Thing is, is you can always make up for it the next day. Right. And we got that 13 mile stretch without water. Um, that's definitely our motivation. But you got to get past dragons too. I'm about to take this jacket off now. Yeah, do it, dude. Got them in the sun. Yeah. Oh, I'm telling you, I'm surprised you wore it this far. What's up, dude? Chilling? Yeah. Yep. Goldie's got to go. We were just walking along and I almost fell and I said, <laughs> we got to start counting each time we, and as soon as I, right before I said fall, I fell and heard a crack and that was the result. Yep, this is Goldie's last hike, and uh, I'm actually going to put her in the backpack now. Damn, sad moment. We're about three miles into it, and boy are we feeling it. It's a good thing that we started late, because we ain't trying to go that far right now. Um, I think we're gonna stop at the shelter right before McAfee Knob and hit McAfee Knob early first day. Hopefully we can catch the sunrise. That would be ideal. That would be cool. But you never know. We say that and then we don't wake up. So we'll see what happens. Feels good to be back. I feel myself a lot.
less than a mile to go to the shelter. John Spring. This guy looks good. Along with the trees. <laughs> looks like I just missed peak week. There's still a little something something left over. We made it to John Spring Shelter. Seven mile day. All right, all right. How you feel, man? Oh, sore. <laughs> yeah. I know that's all right. Oh, get me some sleep. Wake up early. Hit it hard tomorrow. McAfee knobs, Tinker Cliffs. We'll come up for you, sucker. <laughs>